so the NFL game recap is going to have to come tomorrow, but I'm going to be making NFL predictions for the upcoming week, beginning with the Thursday night football game. We have the Cleveland Browns ending the winning streak of the Pittsburgh Steelers. It is Mike Tomlin and the Steelers are going to lose. The Browns are going to suddenly be back in the playoff hunt. The Browns are going to have a 4-6 and six record after they play against the Steelers. It is the Steelers as to Matria of 46, as you see right there. The Baltimore Ravens are going to beat the Houston Texans at home. Baltimore Ravens are going to be 4-1 and one at home. It is Baltimore that equals 41. The other big game, the Patriots and the Eagles. It is the Philadelphia Eagles that are going to pull off the upset against the Patriots. The Eagles are going to have a 4-1 and one record at home this year. The Eagles are going to have a 4-1 record at home. The Eagles beat the Patriots in the Super Bowl. It's Super Bowl that equals 41. It is the Philadelphia Eagles that are going to be on top of the NFC East because the Cowboys are going to lose to the Lions. The Detroit Lions, I think, if Matthew Stafford plays, they're going to have a 4-5-1 and five and one record. It's because the Cowboys has Gematria of 45. The Washington Redskins are going to win at home against the Jets. The Redskins are going to have a 1-4 record at home. It's the end of a losing streak at home. It's end that equals 14. Now, the New York Jets. The New York Jets are going to have an 0-5 record away. Home teams against the Jets are going to be 5-0. Over at America's capital, the Redskins are going to win. It is, let's see here. What other major connection did I have here? What other game was it? The Jaguars are going to beat the Colts. I think that Thursday game, whoever loses, their season is over for the following week. The Texans and the Colts. Big Dick Nick's going to win. I'm going with the Jaguars in that game. The Jags are going to win. The Jaguars are going to defeat the Colts. This guy's a little shaky. His ACL... Do the Colts really need Andrew Luck? Do they really need him? That game just has Jaguars written all over it. It really does. For the Eagles, 4-1 at home. And now for the Patriots, 4-2 and two away. 4-2 and two away. It, it is free. Mason A equals 42. It does beg the question. The Patriots are going to be 8-2. Are the Patriots going to lose against the Cowboys? Not looking like it. Aha, you lost to these guys. You lost to these guys. Uh, uh. Philadelphia's the big upset. And I like to see who Philadelphia has for the following week. Yeah, another MVP game for Russell Wilson. And then the Eagles got the Dolphins. I'm going to go with the Patriots. I'm going to go with the Eagles in that one. Then, hey, the Buffalo Bills are still in the division, right? They're still in the division. Oakland Raiders easily beat the Bungs. The Chiefs get the win. Right before their big game a couple weeks later. And what was that other joke game? Oh, yeah, the Saints can beat the Buccaneers. It's Saints at equals 82. The Saints are 7-2. and two. The Saints are going to be 8-2 because, once again, it is Saints that equals 82. The 49ers are 8-1 before they face off against the Cardinals. The 49ers just played against Seattle. The 49ers are on a short week. The 49ers are on a short week coming off of a game in overtime. The Cardinals are going to beat the 49ers under these circumstances. The Cardinals are going to be 4-6. and six. Jimmy Grappolo is a six life path numerology. The Cardinals win their sixth consecutive game over at the Bay Area. The Cardinals are going to have a 3-3 three and three record away with quarterback Murray. Murray has Dematria of 33. The Cardinals are your big winner to give the 49ers an 8-2 record after their loss against Seattle. And then you know what? 49ers face up against the Green Bay Packers the following, following week. Definitely, that's going to be their record before they face off against Green Bay. 
And these are all the predictions for week 12, I think it is. Or maybe it's week 11. So that's 8, 9, 10, uh, 11. Let's see. The Saints already had the buy. So, you know, this is week 11 for next week. Yeah, the one I'm... I'm, I'm Minneapolis has too much here, 55, doesn't it? I have to go to Bill Belichick's record. So, one more thing to check before the end of the video here. Is it going to be Patriots or is it going to be Eagles? Doug Peterson, can they get two for two against these guys? For now, for now, for now, I have to go with the Eagles, now Carson Woods. Carson Wentz missed out on that Super Bowl. He really did. 18 wins and 6 losses. The Patriots are chasing Super Bowl number 7. 21 and 20 on Sundays. His record against AFC is 8 and 4. Bill Belichick is the Dragon. The Dragon is num number 5 in the Zodiac quarter here. Man, this is a really tough call. I mean, three wins in five games at home. Eagles would have to be five and five because it's... Minneapolis, that's 55. Gotta stick with New England in this one. It's gonna be a close one.